you may have seen this on social media. If not, it's an absolute joy to share this with you. It's a reunion and it was with a nurse, uh, an NHS nurse called Susie Vaughan. And she's a mum of two as well. And um, she basically, she, she took this incredible decision to say that, look, I need to work and I need to be safe and I need to be isolated and I need to protect my children. What did that involve, Ruth? Well, it involved her not seeing her daughters for nine weeks. Her lovely sister took them in. Um, and then when she came back, instead of letting the girls know she was coming back, yeah. her sister Charlotte and her decided that they would yeah. surprise them. So Charlotte so, is filming yeah. this, her sister, and this is what so happened. So this is surprise, surprise. And it's happy oh. tears. It makes me cry. Six be... million times that's been viewed. Yeah, to be or, and loved still like being that. viewed. Let's go to the lady they were all hugging. It's Susie, and beside her there, Hetty and Bella, and we've also got um, uh, Susie's sister Charlotte, uh, who was shooting that um, video there. Uh, Hetty and Bella, I want to come to you first of all. What did you think Auntie Charlotte was actually doing? Or you know, you'd no idea you were looking frontwards, and Mummy was creeping up backwards. What did you think was going on? <laughs> I didn't really know what was going on. We're just, we're just like he said, "What are you doing? What are you doing?" And then, because <laughs> Auntie Charlotte's always taking photos of you, isn't she? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's so lovely to watch Susie. Um, are you pleased now that you did, not, you know, you didn't tell them, and you and you had that wonderful surprise? Yeah. Uh, I didn't tell them because I was worried in case it all changed again because obviously everything's very uncertain still at the moment. So I didn't want to let them down, get their hopes up and let them down. And then as it turned out, they didn't even see me walk in the garden. So it was perfect just to surprise them and see their faces. It's amazing. That is a, a huge decision that you made. At the start of this, um, you, you as a, you're an NHS nurse, you have been for 22 years. Um, what made you, as a mother of two young girls, make that decision to to separate from them? Oh, I'm actually an operating department practitioner, um, an ODP for sure. Um, but my decision, it, it was a really hard decision. Um, I talked it through quite a bit with Charlotte, and um, we just thought it was for the best because um, I was worried what I might be bringing home because I was working in ITU directly with COVID patients and also in the COVID A&E recess. Um, so I was really worried about what I might have been bringing home. But I could also put um, a lot of hours in at work. I was doing nearly 50 hours a week um, and I wouldn't have been able to do that with the girls. And I had to have peace of mind that the girls were safe yeah. um, uh, so I could continue with my job helping uh, patients that needed my help. Well, at this stage, we've got to applaud um, Sister Charlotte, uh, yeah. who's there. And Charlotte, fr from your point of view, you've you've no children of your own as of yet. Um, but uh, this was very good practice for you. Yes. Deep end. Yeah. <laughs> and what was it like? How, the, the idea, the moment where, where Susie's creeping up behind Hetty and Bella and you're filming... Um, it could have gone all wrong, but it went all right. How did you distract them? Um, YouTube. <laughs> um, just put them down in front of the laptop um, and just tried to keep them facing me because obviously I knew where Susie was going to sneak in. So I tried to keep them distracted. Um, and I kept telling Hetty, oh, I'm just taking pictures of you. Keep looking at me. Just, I'm just taking pictures. Mm. And what about your pictures have gone worldwide, internet sensation, millions of views, goodness me. Um, you, you couldn't have realised the impact it would have had. For you, when you look at what you shot, what do you think you got there? Why do you think it appeals to people so much? I think it's just 
a really positive message. Um, you know, we have been through such a big, massive thing. And I think people watch it and it brings them comfort. It brings them happiness, I think. It certainly does that. And we can see there, Susie, not only you've been reunited with Hetty and Bella, but your dog. Tell us about, because <laughs> he's just sitting, was it he or she? It's a she. And what's her name? Lottie. Lottie. Tell us about Lottie then, Bella. Well, she's almost... Nearly 12. She's nearly 12 and she's a Jack Russell cross dashing. Oh. She's beautiful. And did she miss Mummy too? Well, yeah. she stayed with Mummy. She was... Oh, yeah, what I came home to with yeah. a, for a bit of comfort and a bit of cuddle, but she really missed the girls. Yeah. Really oh. missed them. So Auntie Charlotte has her own dog then, has she? What's your dog, four. Charlotte? Four dogs. Four. Four. Yeah, what? Four. <laughs> <laughs> well, well done, all of you. Well done for, um, you know, giving us such joy. Uh, Charlotte, for doing what you do. For Hetty and Bella, for just being so fun and lovely and loving and caring. And uh, Susie, most of all, for you being that operating department practitioner and all that you do, because... You you put you, you're there when people go under sedation. You're there when they wake up again, and you're just there, the epitome of, of of just being a caring professional. Yes. Thank Definitely. you. Well, thank you. Thank you very thank much you. indeed. Thank you all. It's lovely to see you all reunited. Bye, girls. Bye bye. Bye bye, Lottie. <laughs>